Wow, Bill Hickok. Dark Horse Candidate. January 30, 1952. In the rip-roaring wild west cattle town, Jackpot, Kansas, a lawyer's political gang rode roughshod all over its opposition, till only a pair of spinster sisters dared to stand against it. Then out of Abilene came the United States Marshal, Wild Bill Hickok and his deputy jingles, right into the saddle, middle of election fight, where bullets were thicker than bullets, to cast their votes in hot lead for the dark holes candidate. Carol murmurs then, stunning, all right, all right, quiet now, quiet. That's better, well, boys. This ain't going to be the best speech you ever heard. It's one of the shortest. Crowd laughs. Stunning. Here he is, man. The valuable choice. Your man, the favorite dentist, toothless girl food. Crowd cheer. Abby, you can, you can keep him, John Sterling, Bertie. He's not no our man. He's yours. So well, so well. He ain't the Wheelie Wheatley sisters. Better skew the doodle back to your knitting, ladies. Women got no business messing with politics. Crowd laughs and j- agrees. Buddy, you, you don't scare us, you ripper snapper. Abby, no, indeedy. Not you or that bumbly old humbug you call a mayor. Don't let me, it suits me, ladies. I reckon he suits the town. Jackpot too. Right, man? Crowd agrees. Right, John? Said him, hey, no, it's there ain't nobody running against him. But he, but he, no, there was somebody saying, oh, yeah, you mean Ben Nice, the reform candidate? Say, whatever happened to him? I mean, suppose you tell us. Saying, well, it's the last I heard of him. Ma'am, he's running for mayor. I reckon he's still running. Ha <laughs> ha. But, crowd laughs, but, well, you wish you started running. Two John Sterling, when our Bill, our Bill Hickok gets here. Told him, Hickok, in my town? What are you talking about? I mean, well, Mr. Smarty, when Ben Noyce disappeared, he wrote a letter to Ben Boleyn. Don't, didn't we, buddy? But he, yes, indeed, Abby. So in Northern, you tell ID a local and hit the trail toward Abilene. Brother, right. Donovan steps away. Told him, we don't want no federal marshal poking his nose into Jackpot. Hickok, too late, mister. I'm already here. Sonning, how did he? Crowd reacts with surprise. Jingles, that's right, folks, so am I. Abby, oh, my stars and guys, he's come, Betty. Betty, he has, Abby. Saints be praised. Quiet, crowd quiet, stunning. Yeah, he's here. He came to the wrong place, Hickok. Jackals got all the glory it needs or wants. It got, seems to be different of opinion about that, mister. Uh, you mean the Whitney sisters? Why, they're plumb local. Everybody knows that. They got, they made a lot of sense to me just now. Saying, don't be a fool, Hickok. I got the whole team of town behind me. You don't stand a chance, doesn't he, man? I said, well, speak up. I'll crowd of you, gold yellow. You ain't afraid of one man. Jiggle to me. Say, well, I'm not afraid of him. I have a show, show to right, Hickok. I'm running this town, or oh, it ain't. Gunshot. Crowd reacts to consideration. Jingles. Well, sir, it looks like you ain't. Abby, land of living, buddy. Did you just see what I saw, buddy? Did you see it too, Abby? Shot the gun right out of John's hands, Hickok. Don't you ever do that again, mister. It's hard not to be hit. Yeah, at that is range. Crowd quite stunning. All right, Hickok. You win. You don't have to sell this to the guns. We can do it with votes, the fair election. Hickok, the fair election? Usually has more than mankind that. I don't, don't, I want to know what happened to Ben Norris. Sterling convinced. Thing. Uh, he was called out of town unexpectedly. He won't be back till after election. He got no, not until he comes back. Does come back, I think, the town of Jackpot. He's another candidate for mayor. He goes, yeah, Bill, that's a good idea. So, all right, man. 
Your nation now in order. No response. Why, well, God done it, man? It's your duty to move and citizens to end up for your rights. Abby, Bertie, listen. But I am listening, Abby. To Jingles, say, young man, what did you say your name was? Jingles, oh, it's uh, Jingles, madam, that I. But hey, Mr. Hickok, I'm not made to Jingles for man. Jingles, ah, oh, who me? I know a man. I don't want to be no be a man. They go, I hold on, Jingles. We need a candidate on the ballot. Until we find Ben Norris. Jingles, but yeah, but, uh, but Bill. He go, Jingles have been nominated for male jump pop. Do I hear a second? Abby, I second the motion. Crowd reacts, telling you have. you never get away with this, he got. He got all in favour, say I. But in Abby, I. He got any objections? Jingles. Look out, Bill. Gunshot. Crowd reacts of consideration. Jingles. Well, one objection overruled. He got the motion's carried. Jingles been nominated for mayor. Well, Bill and Jingles were seen reviving Jackpot to investigate the disappearance of Ben Norris, a rude form character candidate for mayor. Tangle John Sterling, Memphis leader of the opposition party, political boss of the town, says nobody dares to run, run against Sterling choice. Tiffless Guilford, Jingles was nominated as a dark horse candidate for the mayor of Jackpot. Abby, near and now, Jingles. You look at like a real man, sure enough, Jingles. Well, I feel like a goddamn stuffed ale. This here plug hat. It was swallow up down to coat, Miss Abby. But you old fiddly dee. You look mighty handsome, Jingles. Here, let me brush you off again. Brushing. Jingles, oh, Miss Bertie, you already got me all brushed off and stuck it out. Lipstick like a prize dog at a country fair. Buddy chuckles. Abby, that's enough, buddy. Now, Jingles, you remember what you got to say? Jingles, well, I guess so. But God damn it, I sure hate to go out there and put my big foot in my mouth about Bill being here to help me put it out. Buddy, now you stop fretting about Bill. He is out looking for Ben Norris right now. Jingles, well, I sure hope he finds him before anyone that goes local and lets me mad. Every old stuff and nonsense. You make a good man, real good man, Jingles. You can come along, buddy. And don't forget your speech, Jingles. Oh, all right. Oh, wait a minute. Harry, what do you forget, Jingles? Jingles, that's a belt. Jingles, buy a sick gun, man. Yeah, what well, a crowd out there. I think I need him a lot worse than a cold, hell folding speech. Crowd hollers and jeers. Jingles, now you listen to me, boys. A big kid of men from the south who used to drive their thief through this here town to railroad. The jackpot got to be so much an infernal sore spot, they're going round by the east trail. Now just keep out of trouble here. Crowd agrees. They're right, critters. Jingles, now ain't nobody busy in this town but the undertaker. But here's the cracks, men. That was going to clean itself up real pronto, is it? Or oh, this here little village of yours will be his way being a ghost town. Crowd agrees. Crowd jingles. Now, I ain't said anything that Ben Norris ain't said or already said. I ain't mean, said it better. But when you cast your votes tomorrow, I ain't asking you to vote for me. I'm asking you to vote for the roof on ticket. A Ben Norris and all the things he stood for. Crowd cheers, stunning. All right, all right, now I have something to say. Toothless, come on up here, Toothless. Toothless approaches. Oh, I'm coming, John, I'm coming. Turning to Tringles. Now, you've been sounding all mighty big and fancy about Ben Norris, mister, but you ain't figured well one thing. Tringles, on what's that? Turning, you ain't figured it on Ben Norris. Puzzle crowd reacts, Turning. Now, Toothless here. You've got a letter from Ben Norris this morning. Tringles, huh? Puzzle crowd reacts, Turning. Then I hear and read what he says but to the boys, Toothless. Toothless steps briefly. Toothless, ah, uh, yes, sir, John, yes. He says, ah, uh, dear friend Toothless, congratulations on uh, being such a good man. Keep it up. Toothless, ah, uh, now, 
It goes, it goes on and on, it says. I want all my friends to vote for you. She said, oh, huh, now, let me see that letter. To the, no, I ain't done yet. Says, now, says, because I'm on my way. This is Ben Rain. I'm on my way to California for my good health. Your friend, Ben Norris. Puzzle ground reacts, turning to jingles. How do you like that, Wendy? Kind of upsets your apple cart, doesn't it? Abby, well, I bet no one could write any such thing. But indeed, you wouldn't. You're an old friend, Toothless. Staying well, yeah, well, look for yourself. Look for yourselves, ladies. Right, steps to the sisters. Write a letter. Sorry? Now I ask you, is that band's handwriting or ain't it? Abby, defeat, defeated, yeah. This is right, all right, Betty. Betty? I'm afraid so, Abby. Nobody else in town, nobody else around town could write that nice. She goes, how about that, Billy? Just when I'm getting on so good and speaking up so big and easy and sassy and making so many friends. Pick up, well, cheer up, partner. We ain't lost yet. That letter was only proves one thing to me. She goes, yeah, what's that, Bill? Pick up. It proves that Ben Noyce is still alive. She goes, sure. And what that him and the toothless Trifford be thicker than chicken cheese in a tent house? They got no jingles. I say Ben wrote that note with a gun on his back. Abby, why in merciful heavens, you mean strong study might be holding our John Ben Visioner? Wait, oh Abby, fetch this many salts. I think I'm gonna be gonna faint. And we all know, buddy. Not now, we haven't got time. I got I've been doing a lot of thinking, a lot of looking, Jingles. This morning, I saw Eddie Blake riding to town. It was still levered up. Jingles, well, he's one of Sterling's man of gun sticks, isn't he? I got, yeah, he just made a quick trip somewhere. So I took a look at this horse, and that's what I found in the horse's name. A tail behind Blake brushed him out. But he frizzled pods. But I got right. Now I think Blake brought that letter from Norris. James said, you think he may pick them up them paws on his way, huh? He got right again. And what do you want to know? Where does Fickle, Fizzle grow around these parts? I mean, well, there's only one place that I know of, Marshall. But in Buffalo Pass. He got good. Thanks, ladies. Come on, Jingles. Let's get settled up. I think we find Ben Norris at Buffalo Pass. If not, it's not too late. If it ain't, if it ain't, if it not, I ain't too late. Two gabbing horses' hooves. Hickok and two angles have to shout to hear each other. Hickok, there's Buffalo Pass dead ahead to Jingles. Jingles, yeah. Say, Ben, what in tarnation is this fellow Sterling I got up to anyway? Hickok, I don't know. But it looks like him and his gang must have just shout, run, uh, run jetpot into the ground. Jingles, where well, what? He couldn't have busted the town any further. Then he's doing, it's the, it's on purpose. So everybody's setting up. He got, yeah, the stadium's the one who's buying up 30 cents on a dollar. Jingles, yeah, but I still ain't savvy, Bill. He got, look, Jingles, moat rising from those rocks ahead. Jingles, sure enough, someone's got a campfire going up there. He got, where? Well, yeah, let's keep close to this side of the pass. We don't want to, uh, them to see us till we, Echoing boom and rock ricochet of distant gunfire. Jingles, oh, whoa. Oh, looks like they're already seen us, Bill. They got, come on, partner. Let's take cover behind us, that boulder. Bang, hiccups, shooting back. Jing town. Now you're talking, Bill. Jump. To horse, jump, Joker, go. Horse hooves fill as they get up to boulder and slow down in agreement. They got, Horse, whoa, buckshot, whoa, steady boy. Jingles the horse, hold, Joker, hold. Stay, stand, stand steady now. Horses stop and snuffle. Jingles, oh, there, I see, Bill. Bang on hiccups, shooting back. Jingles the one of Sterling's men. He got, yeah, flip, jump, none of them. Jingles, yeah, looks like he's alone up there. Hiccup, yeah, that's funny. Cause, hey, Donovan, listen, Donovan. I can hear you, mister. Hickok. I'm Hickok, Virgil Marshall, a noise. Stay back, Sheriff. You'll be killed. Donovan, I told you, shut up, Norris. Jingles, listen. Bill, bit noise is up there. Donovan, now I'm warning you, Norris. 
One more peep at you, and I'll plug you right where you lie. Try it up or not. Boris, you know, don't be local flip. That's Buffalo Bill Hickok down there. You won't stand a chance of him. Don't know where you be. Not in a fair fight, Norris. We ought to know me better than that. Bang. Donovan takes a shot. Hickok below. Norris, what do you mean? Don't know where to get where we are. Hickok's got to ride straight up this pass. See? I am right under that cramp. A stage in the middle of it. I bet it's enough time to blow him. In fact, that would be way to Texas. No, I see. You are. Are you crazy, Flip? You don't want to do that? Don't want to know. No. What kind of chance would I stand, stand shooting it out with Bell, with Bell Bill? No, sir. You see this little old box here? I can set off that charge right here when I see you come, come in. Bang. Donovan takes a gun. Shot a pickup below. Donovan. Ah, I have bullets. Are we better reload? Gun breaks, bullets loaded. Donovan. Hey, you cut. Co- they're coming. Hey, hey, yeah, coming. They're almost close enough. Norris. Stay back, Hickok. It's a trap. Donovan. Here's the last of Bill Hickok. Well, I'll pick up now. Do some of my space dynamite explosion. By the order of John studying political bosses black pot, by noise and missing reform candidate of a mayor, being held prisoner by Flip Donovan. Now as well Bill and Jingles ride down Buffalo passed the noise to rescue. Donovan explodes the dynamite charge, right in the path of their own rushing horses. Dynamite explosion, two galloping horses approach. Donovan there, that'll stop them. Wait till the smoke clears and we'll see. Horse wine means. Jingles come on, Bill. There he is. Let's get him. Pick up. Up, up, shot. No, it's high. It didn't work, Donovan. It's still coming. You get, you got scared and pushed that work switch too soon. Donovan. Hey, wait a minute. I'll give up, Hiccup. Don't shoot. I'll give up. Was this slow and walk, walk behind, Hiccup? Oh, buckshot. Whoa, to something. All right, Donovan. Stand right where there and don't move. Donovan. I don't want to do it, Marshal. Sterling made me do it. I didn't want to. Jingles, but he did. But he did. Yeah, but he did do it. Dog, dog, yeah. And my ears are still ringing. What's this little hiccup? You right, Mr. Norris? Norris, sure, sure, Marshal. Soon as I get untied here, Jingles. Well, I have been. I have you loose as Jiffy. Jingles dismounts, Donovan. Uh, say, that's not my idea, Marshal. Jingles, now, Mr. Norris, we'll get you back to town. We're in a real good meal beside you. Then you can tell us the whole story. Donovan, I'll tell you. I'll tell you everything. I thought you'd get your chance to talk, Donovan, to the jury. Abby, there, you feeling better now, Ben? Doris. Yes, much better now, thanks. That hot soup tasted real good, Bernie. Why, well, you poor man, you've been through an awful lot. Jingles, I sure this. Yes, Miss Bertie. I know. Come to think of it, so have I. <laughs> Say, ain't got any more of that hot soup left, have you? I mean, oh, why, bless your heart, Jingles. We must forget all about you. Now, you just sit down and wake up now. Wait a minute, Jingles. Let's hear the rest of the, rest of the story. Nice, well, Bill, studying. Why did you keep me out of the race, you see? I made a mistake of telling him all about my deal with the railroad. Jingles, ah, oh, so that was that, 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 what was that deal, Ben? Yes, he promised me if I elected me, I would clean up the test town, if I unspur a line down from the, the train track to Ketman, could load their beef right here. But you know, it saved them two days of trip. He got that's why Stunning was so anxious to take over the business here. Or business here. Very sure, well, sure. Why, a spur line would bring a heap of prosperity, prosperity to that pot. You think he'd clean up the town himself? Jingles him? Clean up the town? <laughs> he got sure, Jingles. I've elected his own mayor, ran off the honest merchants. He'll get all that, get that spur line. And there he is, he'll open up the stores again, 
have all the profits to himself. But he's next alive, that's terrible, man. What do we do next? Gunshot, window glass shatters. Final game hollers outside. Ray grass. Look out, Miss Buddy. Jingles, there's there, your answer. Ma'am, it's Jingles in his game, stunning his game. The race said, come back and finish the job. I got put out that lamp, Jingles. Oh, so it's lighting up their target for him. Jingles, right, Bill. Jingles steps scramble to the jump. Abby, oh my stars and gutters, Stanley. Let them have it, but have it, boys. Gang briefly whoops and hollers. Agreement. Gunshots exchange. Jingles, go, go, I can't, I can't see them out there in the dark. I got cheer up, partner. They can't see us either. No, it's why I have, they must be five of them out to one of them. Five of them to one of us, Bill. I got, yeah, it sure looks, sure looks bad. Wait, wait a minute. I've got an idea. Wait, well, yeah. I got, you keep shooting jingles. Ben, you come with me. Keep down. Miss Bernie? Miss Abbott? Abby, yes, Marshal. Bernie? Bernie, what is it? I got, you got a clothes eye running on the window. The shop to that big tree out there, haven't you? Abby, yes, yes. I got, good. We're going to try the trick we used once in a tiny war, in the war. Your ladies to put, Start putting out some clothes there on hangers and stuff them with rags, straw, anything you've got. Oh, well, all right, if you say so, but I don't. They got, I tell you, Ben, you hang them up to the line and slide them out towards the tree. Might as well, sure, Bill. Well, what's the idea? They got, I'm hoping the dark, those dummies look enough like us. Draw their fire and give Jingles me a chance to slip out the front door and really get to those buzzers. Bunny? Well, what are we waiting for, Abby? Let's do it. Gunshots. And gunshots only from Sterling, man. Sterling, keep shooting, man. They can't hold out in there forever. Blake, something's funnier going on, John. Same with her. Blake, they ain't shooting back. Same here. I think maybe you got them, Eddie. Nah, nah. It's some kind of trick. Blake, hey, look. Ain't there something moving out there? Say, hey, where? Hey, it's... It's... Uh, it is, it's them. They're all getting out, they're getting out of the side window. Come out, well, come on, boys, around to the side. Get them, let's get them. Gang ringing steps, they whoop and holler, while firing a volley of gunshots. Oh, except for occasional gunshots, all grows quite behind. Blake, hey, John, what's wrong? He pump and put plum full of lead. He's still standing there. I'm getting scared. See? Hey, this is going... What's going on here? Hold your fire, boys. Let's see about this. Gunshot shots, done in game, hurry, steps, are closed on. Hey, look, Eddie. He's nothing but a bunch of clothes hanging on a line. Hiccup tricked us again. Well, here is the wrong way. Hiccup right behind you, Sterling. Sterling started with discrimination. Hiccup, drop your guns, all of you. Blake to Sterling. It's Wild Bill, John. Yeah, Jingles, now drop them to boys, you heard what Bill said. Same defeated. They've got us, Billy. All right, throw down your guns, man. <coughs> Disgruntled gang grumbles and drops guns to the ground. Norris steps for the approach. Norris, well, well, looks like it's worked. Pick up, sure did, Ben. This is the whole game. No, I said, yep, all but all toothless. He didn't count any of him. Like, he did that. Bister said his campaign was getting too hot. Said he was getting out of crooked politics into some honest line work. Jingles unlikely. And know that, what, you know what, Ben? Now that you're back, I'm going to do the very same thing. Abby Bertie stepped for approach. Abby Wells seems alive, Jen. It leaves you the clear field, doesn't it, buddy? But it sure does, Abby. We're going to win. It got, looks like you already have, ladies. And now, gents, you can start moving straight up to the gang uh, jailhouse. Gang steps trudge off. Fingers, well, so long, ladies. Abby, goodbye, Jingles, and thanks. But you still think you made a nice, real nice mare, Jingles. Jingles, well, madam. You know, I like kissing babies and even speech making. I ain't so bad, but dog on it. That plucker you make me wear makes me f- 
Good and tough, too good to say. He he he. And now, the end of the story of Wild Bill Hickok. <laughs>